All right, we are here. Absolutely nobody expected this, but yeah, we are in the playoffs somehow, and we are currently up 2-1 to one against the Sharks. I kind of want to go and recap how the end of our season went, because after the trade deadline, I think we lost, like, maybe one game. Also, I'm going to try keeping these on <laughs> for today, so let's see how many times my eye disappears from the green screen thing picking it up. But anyway... So, after the trade deadline so far, I see one loss, and that will maybe be the... Oh, we have another overtime loss, which, by the way, yeah, they're both in OT. We have one loss to the Blues, one loss to the Avalanche, and that was it. Yep, that was that's all she wrote for losses after the trade deadline. So, I'm not sure... Oh, I, I'm just trying to roughly count right now, but it to me, it seems like we went 15-2-2. Two and two after the deadline. That is just absurd. Okay, well, let's view the lines. So we got Johnny Goudreau, Lambert, and Olofsson, and then we've got Bjorkstrand, Nico Heischer, and Andreas Muller. To Foley, oh, uh, that's a tough one. That is a tough one. Benoa, possibly? I'm not sure, but either way, Tippett, Kapusta, Kapusta, <laughs> and Estroza, and Kovanov. And then on defense, we've got Kleppbaum, Truba, Pareko, Hamilton, Shillington, and Stetcher. And then we've got Tino Mans with Nadeljkovic. <laughs> That's not right, but I tried. Also, I know it's a few videos later from that comment, but I am now turning up the attribute effects to hopefully help the simulation a little bit. Someone pointed that out, and hopefully it works because it's just crazy right now. Okay, we have the San Jose Sharks here. We have a 2-1 series lead. Boom! We are up 1-0 after 1, and we are up 2-1 after 2. So let's go ahead and jump in. And hopefully we can keep this lead. I am also outrageously hungry right now. And I have a... I'm probably not going to use the audio from it. But I have one of those clip-on lav mics. And I kind of want to just test it out. I know I used it once for an outdoor video. And if I start doing more outdoor videos, then I guess I'll have to try using it again. But I'm also going to have to see about like audio restoration. Because it picks up quite a lot. So it's pretty loud. And yeah, it's just like, it peaks a lot. So maybe I'll have to get a more expensive lav mic or find a way to record and, you know, not have it pick up the level so high. But I'm not too sure that that is something that can be adjusted. Oh boy, that was close. That's my first, do shots off the post count as a shot? I want to say they do. Oh no, oh no, he got it. What a save off the blocker. Holy smokes, that was wild. I was not ready for that shot, but... Apparently, Tino Mans was, because that was a huge save. That was an amazing play by 11 there. Just kind of faked him out entirely. Did some statuing as well, kind of threw him off, you know. If he's, I guess the other guy was like a B. If you stand still, you won't know you're there or something, which probably isn't even true. But there we go. Another massive save on Huberdo, who walks out just free will again. Let's go. Fire me up, boys. That's 3-1 now. We have a two-goal lead. The worst lead in hockey makes its way back into this one here. I'm hyped. We are actually, hopefully, if I do not crap the sheets, we will have a two-game series lead here. That is, however, an extremely large if. Big save and big save. Oh, my. Are you kidding me right now? I am just, un I don't know what to say. I'm going to say it's the glasses. In the middle, and that is a missed net if I've ever seen one. I'm not going to hug the post right now. Good job, Dallas. Getting it out. I like it. Man, we still have 12 minutes to go, too. That seems like a lot of time. I feel like this period is going super slow right now, but that's okay. We still have the two-goal lead, and we are not getting dominated by any means here. So it's not like we have a lot to worry about. That could have been so sick. If he got that back to Vicky, that would have been just unbelievable. Oh yeah, here we go, Stars. Way to move the puck, wait! 15. You had your back in there. That was probably one of the easier tucks you would have gotten in your entire career. And it was a playoff goal, nonetheless. Johnny Goods, I'm not mad. I'm just simply disappointed. Oh boy, oh boy. Kasha, there we go in the mitten. I kind of had a feeling he wasn't going to pass that. I don't know why, but... I don't know. Intuition, I suppose. Huberto's got it. Goes past in the middle to Jimmy. Get it out, guys. I don't know how Jimmy ended up on his back there, but it is what it is. Get the puck out. Great job, Stars. Fire me up. We are playing unreal right now. 
This is like, we pretty much are St. Louis. Three and a half to go here. We still have that lead. And I might have just jinxed it. Oh, wow. I slid way too far to the right. And the puck meets Irene. Luckily, I think me and the post are on talking terms again now. That was unreal. Sick goal as well. I mean, he could have shot that 10 years earlier. Would have been a lot less stressful. But he had to wait. Okay? It's still a goal. So, I'm not going to complain. But true, but maybe next time. Maybe work on your quick release there a little bit. Nice. Just able to walk right out like Huberto. It's wonderful that our team's able to do it too. Final minute of action here, folks. We have 50 seconds. And we now have an icing. So there will be a face-off to the left of Tino Manny. Two goals separate the teams right now. And 50 seconds separates us from victory. Which will put us up in a very, very nice spot in this series. So hopefully we can hold it. Here we go, stars. It's looking real good so far. I have no reason to believe that we might blow this lead right now. But that could change in a heartbeat. We'll just have to see what happens. Nice giveaway. boy, Sharks guy. Love it. Olofsson in the middle. One-timer. And that will bury this game. There is no shot they're coming back now. What a goal, too. Here come the Sharks. One last attack here. Roslovich with a low shot. That's a save. Kind of gave out the biggest rebound known to man. But luckily, Duchesne wasn't in the right spot to pick it up. And that is a massive win for the Stars here. I, I was going to say, I got to be one of the Stars. There we go. Third star. 27 saves, man. So I had 28 shots and only let up one goal. That is disgusting. Will we hear from James? If I, you know, had to place a bet on it, I would say no. Yeah, the odds are definitely in favor of no James. But I guess it's always possible. Let's see here. Come on, are we just going to be selling? Yeah, there's no James. It would have already popped up. All right. Once again, James is MIA in playoffs. And look at that. We are headed back. Was there like a step there? Or did my guy just shrink? Or am I crazy? Because that's also possible. But it looks like we're heading back to Dallas. And we could close this series out early. I also don't know if I showed you guys this. But here's the playoff tree right now. So we will be facing, if we win, either the Jets or the Blues next. That would be ironic, really, facing the Blues. But yeah, this is the teams in the playoffs at the moment. All right, let's see if we can take the Sharks out in five hockey games here. First period, 2-1. Second period, 4-3. Not great for the goalies here, but... The Stars still have the lead, so let's jump in and try to bring this one home. Oh, I actually never noticed this, but you can kind of see, like, the outline of the fighting strap on the back of the jersey there, which is kind of neat. It's just, you know, I guess nothing major, obviously, but it's pretty cool that they added that in still. Nice pass! Oh, my word, Vicky! That would have been an unbelievable goal. Holy smokes, man. He got a hold of that thing, but unfortunately... Could not beat the post. That was also a good shot. Threw Holpe off guard there. Still not able to get one in. But come on, we got to get one soon here. This is unbelievable pressure from the Dallas Stars right now. I have not had... Here we go. This is their first time coming over the line yet. And it's, well, still 17 minutes to go. So I guess the period is still very early here. Is there an easy way to kind of swap back and forth between goalie equipment in this game? Or do I have to go back and re-edit everything? Because that'd be sick if they had like two or three layouts for goalie equipment so I could have a jersey or sorry, uh, an equipment setup, I guess. I don't know what to say for these jerseys as well. You know, that would be unreal. You just kind of go into the thing, hit a button, and you're on to your next equipment set. Or I guess you could even do it from the main part there. Just like a bumper or something. Are those even used? Actually, I guess they kind of are. But, you know, there's got to be some way you could do that. Robbie Fabry. Oh, up to Forsberg. What's happening? I don't like it. Get this puck out right now. Thank you. Good job, Fives. Nice skate. And great pass to 7-1. Come on to Foley. Oh, man. He was about to shoot it. But he got knocked off balance. And now here come the Sharks. Robbie Fabry with it in the neutral zone. Now across the blue. Robbie Fabry going for a deke. Oh! Okay. Okay. What's happening? Please get the puck out. That is what I would like to call pure luck. <laughs> There's no skill behind them not scoring there. Really? That should have been... Like, I was about to say 3-1, but then I realized, nope, that was last game. And that would have been the first goal last game, I think. 
Well, yeah, either way. That should have been 5-3, guys. Come on. The Sharks took a tripping call. That is massive for us. 8.48 to go here. If we get a goal, this could potentially end the shark season so let's see what dallas can do for these next two minutes lambert passing it back to hamilton who lets a shot go through a crowd not able to get it in in 14 at a prime opportunity but it went off the defender's leg unfortunately come on vicky goes to walk out nice job guys oh that was a howitzer as well man we are quite the team all of a sudden where was this in the first well i was gonna say first half but i guess the trade deadline happens more than halfway through, but you know what I mean. What a goal. Pardon me? Are we just that sick, or what's up? Shooting stars straight for the Stanley Cup. Yep, that's a sign. <laughs> no way! No way! Oh my gosh! They just trapped whoever that poor man was. Oh my- well, you might as well trade him because he's one of us now. Holy crap, we just absorbed that player. Who even was that? Will that be in the instant replay? I kind of hope it will be. I want to go see that. That is jokes. He got trapped in the middle, and they just consumed that person. Unfortunately, you can't see it on the replay. That sucks, but that was unbelievable. Guy has officially become one with the stars. Get another one. Why not? You know, why would we want the worst lead in hockey? Might as well score six goals, I think. Jimmy Superstar to Kasha. That's a tip, and that is a save. Good stuff. Huberdeau. You actually thought you were going to have that. Let's try to get Nico the hat trick here as well. <laughs> okay. Knocks him over and then proceeds to trip over the person that he had just knocked over. You know, you think you would know he's there, but I guess not. Only two minutes separate the stars from round number two right now, which is crazy. Who do you guys think we're going to get? I'm confident. I'm going for it. I'm just going to say we're going to win. Who are we going to get? The Blues or the Jets? Go ahead and tell me. I think we're going to get the Blues just because it would, you know, it's got to work out like that pretty much at this point. Nice pass. Ooh, that was a deadly shot. Looks like you injured that man's. Shouldn't have gotten the way, bud. All right. We are doing a great job of killing the clock here too now. Sharks Tendy is out. 45 seconds are on the clock. Dallas has possession. This guy is like, I, wow. He had the whole team chasing him. That's impressive. That guy deserves a raise. Even though that's not really how this works. I hope he gets some kind of bonus just for that. I hope it was in his contract. Like, you know, game whatever of the Stanley Cup Finals. We're on the verge of making it to the next round. Have the whole team chase you. You get an extra $500,000. I would sign that. There's actually multiple ways to achieve that. You could also throw an extremely dirty hit. And then... The whole team might chase you as well. Okay, will we score an empty netter? Yes, we will. It's going to be a 6-3 victory for your Dallas Stars. And we are officially moving on to round number two. Let's go. How did this even happen? I, I At the trade deadline, I was so down and out. Basically gave up. And now here we are. Like, are you serious? Okay, don't be that happy. It's only round one, guys. I don't think people throw their sticks for round one. You know, they kind of just go, yeah, pretty cool. Let's go. And then these guys are kind of like, oh, that sucks. But also, I get to golf. So they still only ended up with 22 shots and three goals. So definitely still not a good performance by any means from Tino Mans. But either way, we're still moving on to round two. Now, will this event call for something from James? I'm looking to say it probably will not. No, no James once more. Just a happy squad here walking off. You know, you got to... Get all happy, tilt your head to the sky, and we have... Wow. Really, team play? You're gonna do me dirty like that? Unbelievable. Even though that stuff really, I don't think, matters anymore. Alright, let's simulate and find out who our next round opponents will be. Will it be the Blues, or will it be the Jets? Any day now. Any day now. There we go. Stop the simulation, and we get the Blues! It just had to happen, you know? So right now, Tino Manny has a 909, 237, and a record of 4, 1, and 0. Oh. And the Blues are 4, 2, and 0. Oh. So this is going to be quite the matchup. I will probably review this in the next video as well, just to keep it fresh on your mind. But for now, just to see what we're going up against here, let's head to the St. Louis Blues statistics. Oh boy, that's scary. He's 30? Man, I've been doing this be a pro for a while. <laughs> Holy crap. 
They got Lafreniere as well. They also got Trevor Wong. Holy crap. They got like every prospect that turns out to be unreal. They also got Morgan Riley, Beauvillier, Nuge, Saad, Mantha. What overall is Mantha? 86? Yeah, okay. Tuck probably 84. Nice. Shen, Texier. All right. They have a pretty good team here for sure. Who do they got in net? They've got... Georgiev at 85. All right. And Corby Solo at 84. So they got two good goalies. I also never really checked because I was so peeved from the season. Okay, I ended up finishing good. I ended up going with a 913, 248, and five shutouts. 35, 26, and three. Okay. Decent. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. I look forward to seeing you in round number two where we start our adventure against the St. Louis Blues. We have home ice advantage here, which is great stuff. And yeah, I guess I'll see you guys then. So be sure to leave a like if you enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll catch you later.